What if all green plants disappeared for one month? If every green plant on Earth, from microscopic phytoplankton to towering sequoias, vanished for 30 days, the planet would face an immediate and irreversible catastrophe. The first and most terrifying impact would not be suffocation. While the planet's primary oxygen factories would shut down, the atmosphere holds a vast reservoir of O2, enough to sustain animal life for far longer than 30 days. The true crisis would be starvation. Within the first 48 hours, the global food supply chain would collapse. All agriculture, rice paddies, wheat fields, corn fields, orchards, and vegetable farms would become barren soil. Supermarket shelves would be stripped bare in a wave of global panic. But the human crisis is only part of the story. A silent global mass extinction would begin. All herbivores, from insects and rabbits to cattle and elephants, would lose their only food source. Mass die-offs would occur within the first week. This would trigger the second wave of collapse. Carnivores and omnivores, including humans, who depend on those herbivores would soon follow. The oceans would be equally devastated. The disappearance of phytoplankton, the base of the entire marine food web, would starve the krill, which in turn would starve the fish, penguins, seals, and whales. Simultaneously, the planet's environment would destabilize. Without plant roots to bind it, massive soil erosion would choke rivers with sediment and create colossal dust storms. Without transpiration, local weather patterns would shift violently. Meanwhile, carbon dioxide levels would begin to climb unchecked, as nothing would be left to absorb it. When the 30 days are over, the plants might theoretically reappear, but they would return to a barren, silent world. The intricate web of life built over millennia would be shattered forever.